if there's one thing that makes my hair journey a very difficult one i'm gonna choose dandruff <laughs> Um, I've talked about it before, it forms large sheets under my hair, so I, it's overlying my scalp and when you wash it out, it tends to form flakes and it joins with my hair, it binds to it kind of, so even getting it out is very difficult. Now, before I started this log journey, I kept wondering to myself how I'm going to deal with dandruff issues while i'm trying to lock my hair because now i don't even have to be washing my hair often because we want the hair to lock properly as they are very tiny and short so what you're seeing right now is three weeks of no water in my hair um, as you can see the flakes are flaking the scalp is quite dirty in quotes from the dandruff now, because this, you're not seeing the sheets right now because I've been cleaning with green tea. If you've not seen that video, you can click right here and watch it. I've been cleaning with green tea for some time, so um, the sheets kind of break off and they come out. But some of them are stuck in my hair like you can see right now. And it's crazy, man. It's so crazy. Um, I've not been able to get selenium sulfide. According to the literature, it's the best if you want to just kill this fungi that are causing this dandruff off. But I can't find it. I just hope if I go to another city in my country, I can get some. But in the meantime, I've been trying my best to clean it and it's really not coming out. So I just wanted to update you guys on how it's been going so far. If you have hair like mine, you really need to watch out for those dandruff issues if you have dandruff if you have short hair you want to start locks you really need to consider how you're going to be dealing with the itching the flakiness sometimes you find some of your clothes it's crazy out here girl it's crazy out here and i am stuck i, I just see, can't seem to find the right thing to do right now back when i had loose hair it was easier for me to deal with my dandruff because all i had to do is just get in the shower and wash it off so most times you won't see the flakiness except i haven't washed my hair say in like a week but most times i'd wash it like twice a week at least twice a week you know but now that i have locks and it's in its formative stages and i can't wash my hair i'm quite stuck if you know any solution that can help me please comment down there below i'd love to try something new <laughs> so there's more of the flakiness i was talking about um it's um this was shot um before i got my first wash since the three weeks ultimatum that was given to me um it's, it's amazing you wouldn't even know that i've been cleaning it at least with green tea <laughs> but at least relative to if i didn't use green tea it would have been worse so i'm really grateful <laughs> this video is just a cry for help for any kind of assistance i can get i really appreciate it honestly um, if any of you guys are watching, you've had this problem before, or you know somebody else who has my hair type with this standard of issue, please comment down below. I'd love, 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 love to know. Um, yeah, and that's it, really. That's all this video is about. <laughs> anyway, thank you for watching. Do help a sister.